always love art every time I go around the country, whether or not statues or anything to take photographs of. If I see something, oh, I got to pull over and get that shot. And guess what? One of the guys who designs many of the things that you see across the country happens to be this guy. What's your name? Uh, John Cerny. Sir, oh, wait a minute. I know you because you are in the process <laughs> of making a huge uh, George Harrison guitar for Benton, Illinois, aren't you? Yes, sir. You, and you inspired me, Flash. Tell me how that happened. You heard me on the air talk about Benton, Illinois and the George Harrison connection? Yeah, you know, I, I get a kick out of hearing your story about you know, your travels. Yeah. And I, well, I was one day I was coming back from a, a mural project I just was talking. I heard you telling the story with a caller about George Harrison being the first Beatle uh, to visit America several months before they hit the uh, yeah. Ed Sullivan show in 64. And, you know, I'm a Beatles fan. I'd never heard the story about him visiting, visiting his sister in a small town in southern Illinois. So by the time I was I got it home, I said, wow. There's, there's something about this story. I need to hear more about it and do some research. And I saw it visually as a mural, but it took me a while. But uh, it's so cool that uh, um, it was such a great story and all the things that George did while he was visiting his sister. And uh, it was just an easy thing for me to uh, come up with the concept and uh, talk to the city. And I'm donating it to the city. So it's just one of those things I get passionate about. Are they into it and they're going to be able to display it somewhere along the highway where people will see it? Yeah, all I ask for is that, that they find me a place, and it'd be nice if you could pay me uh, for my gas and hotel and come out back. <laughs> yes. They, they, <laughs> they, took, they took some photos of different, a couple of different uh, places to put it, and they got us placed next to their airport, next to a busy highway. You may even know the highway. It's a 57 that runs north and south. Sure, yeah. yeah. I mean, I-57, very big out there. So that may, may make people want to stop and see the Beatles connection in southern Illinois from 1963 because of your artwork. But once or twice a year, I like to have fun with projects like this that no one tells me what to do. I just have fun with my plywood cutouts and you're driving down the road and it, it kind of throws you for a loop because I'm not trying to sell you anything. I'm just trying to entertain you as you're driving down the road. <laughs> and that's what it's all about. And that's why I love it. Uh, just traveling down and I want to get photos of myself with Americana that is out there where people can see and say, oh, I want to go see that. Now that I know that that's there, it really adds Adds to your experience of trying to find some of the historical spots and thanks to you with your creative knowledge that you have it's fun idea oh my gosh well it is so good talking to you and i look forward to it and going out and photographing myself with it to have that online too that'd be terrific price thanks again for inspiring me oh my Razor beam in my dreams, get on, get on. Razor beam like it's all about dreams. <laughs> Billy Blue. <laughs> yeah. <laughs>